following. So we're going to use the product rule here. So y prime is going to be equal to the derivative of sine of x times cosine of x plus sine of x times the derivative of cosine of x. So what we'll have here is this is going to become cosine of x times cosine of x. And then the derivative of cosine of x is going to be equal to uh, negative sine of x. So we end up with cosine squared of x minus, because this minus here, sine squared of x. And that's it. Alrighty, I hope this helped you out. I appreciate you watching this video, and you have yourself a great day.